Christian News Leader. This is News Channel 13, where the news comes first. A special treat for residents in Black Forest, but last summer, it wasn't so sweet for the brothers handing out the free ice cream. We're going to have their story. And can an old mining town save a jewel of a historic building damaged by lightning? We're going to show you how they're trying to do just that. And a bank had an unexpected withdrawal this morning. We're going to tell you what happened. Hello and thanks for joining us for KRDO News Channel 13 at 6 o'clock. I'm Jonathan Petromala. Well, it's a sweet homecoming for two brothers from Black Forest tonight, handing out a tasty treat to neighbors and kids from the place they call home. But this is a stop on a very unusual road trip that has even more meaning to the brothers. New at 6, KRDO News Channel 13's Eric Fink joins us live in studio to tell us why. Eric. Jonathan, the Cruz brothers pulled into their Black Forest house they grew up in today in this right here. Many neighbors waiting for some dessert and a chance to welcome them back home. Yes. Caleb and Cameron Cruz are loving their summer vacation in this, giving away free ice cream to all who come up to the window and helping to empower kids to explore their worlds the way these brothers are doing, one scoop at a time. An ice cream truck is just such an incredible way where you can be new to a community, a complete stranger, and then, you know, bring out a whole, uh, a whole group of people. Uh, it really breaks down barriers. The Cruises got a National Geographic Young Explorers grant earlier this year to drive an ice cream truck cross-country, meeting thousands of people through thousands of scoops of ice cream. It's a sweet, environmentally friendly summer ride that runs on vegetable oil. They're back today on the property they grew up on. Their home completely destroyed in the Black Forest fire a little more than a year ago. Now rebuilt with an addition in the front yard. This is where we did our dreaming, our exploring, and this is like just where we're, where we're from. This is our home. And so as hard as that was to see happen to our family, to be back here today where kind of all this dreaming and exploring and started is, is incredible. And it, it's something that I just can't even put into words. Caleb thought of this idea three years ago in his dorm room at Stanford. The thought of driving an ice cream truck cross country, handing out free ice cream, well, that dream is slowly becoming a reality. They're zigzagging across the country and they're going to end up in New York City in late September as their final destination. Of course, eating ice cream all along the way. For these hometown boys, the anything but ordinary flavors and anything but ordinary idea come to life. Well, kudos to them. The brothers raised about $18,000 through a Kickstarter campaign to help fund their trip. They are making a documentary for National Geographic kids along the way. In the Newsplex tonight, Eric Fink, KRDO News Channel 13. And no ice cream brought back from Eric Fink tonight. Well, Black Forest firefighters are helping out in Northern California.